swift action to get help. That's the promise Governor Neil Abercrombie made to those who are still without power, water, and supplies. Abercrombie did a ground assessment today of the damage in Puna. He visited and toured the Nunavali Community Center to thank volunteers and got an update on supplies. He says he's going to work his hardest to file the proper federal declarations to get those folks the assistance they need. We're getting it there as fast as it's possible, humanly possible to do. The guard, the county workers, everybody are moving as fast as it's possible uh, uh, to, to have it happen. Um, of course, uh, no one wants to be in a situation where they don't have their electricity, where they don't have their water, but I can, I can guarantee you this. Everybody is working as hard as they can, as fast as they can, to see to it that life come back, comes back to normal as quickly as it's possible to take place. The governor also briefly touched on the election, saying it is not his decision. It's up to the Office of Elections and not the executive office on whether to hold the election. We also spoke today to Hawaii County Mayor Billy Kinoy, who was also on the ground assessing the damage and helping with the relief efforts. The most important thing is there wasn't a single loss of life. You know, things that are broken we can fix. Stuff that are lost we can replace. But we're so happy and thankful that there was no loss of life or serious injury reported because of this cell. The mayor says there are about 150 National Guard troops on the ground to help prevent looting and any other issues.